Welcome. Select for the grappling hook. Select shouldn't even be part of the game. Select should be like for the menus or something. I mean, jeez, like were they trying to just ruin this game? Just flat out, just fuck it up? Well, they did. Batman Forever. It sucked back then, and it sucks forever. Oh, it's okay. It's just cake. Just cake. That's it. Just That's cake. all the shitty Batman cake, games my, I can take. Oh, oh, it's it's so so tasty. Batman! Batman, you want to play a pretty really shitty Nintendo mm. game, Batman? What about oh, that shit? Return of the Joker and the Nintendo Batman? I'm not really Batman, though. You're not Batman! Batman, you're Batman! I'm Batman! Come on, Batman, let's play! Come on! Come on, Batman, let's play! Come on, Batman, let's play! I'm not playing any more shitty Batman. I cannot watch this train as you are in it. Simply walk two faces to the left. Oh, and then find the faces straight ahead. Come oh, on, dude. You must remember strategy. I need you to remain in the game with me. Will the Bat Nerd escape the Joker? What bad games does he have up his sleeve? Tune in next episode. Same bat time. Same bat channel. Time to move on to the next challenge. That's your butt! Yes! Cody! I got the dress! What? How? Does she have some kind of creepy wedding dress radar implanted in her? because the Joker's new title and playing like Batman Return of the Joker on NES. Death? It's a follow-up to the Do first Batman part? game on the okay. NES. They so couldn't no wait for the next movie to come out, so you had to make an instant sequel. Right? Unlike the first game right? where you have the option to punch or You're switch so between inventory weapons, this game basically gives you one weapon, a bat gun. So you can get, get a lot of upgrades for this weapon, but can't help but find it strange that Batman is just going around shooting people into the ammo and never using his fists. And then the NES game, you've got the graphics are good, and the music, once again, is awesome. First pair to Seems like so Sunsoft games always have good music. Last and a pimped-out wedding reception request. in first class. Yeah, I said that. Heather and Alejandro you need to make won Batman the challenge, dance so to music I'm giving them a head start. Ready, his head. Mrs. Alejandro? Only if you are, Mr. Heather. I'm here to make a guard. Because the balls weren't quite unpleasant enough. I don't know what purpose that has. We stopped them with hungry, hungry shots. But when we get to the ball, the music sounds incredibly Sure, no, no, I'm like a buffet to them. I know you have a fondness for that. Dragon Man too. Yeah, it, it but does so sound like it. Makes it a lot faster. Yeah, yeah, all right. Once and you get to the third stage, off, the game gets way too difficult, next. way too it's fast. Quite... You're so slipping around on the ice, trying yeah. not to fall. So and I let him think I was going along with it. Even Nobody after tells a lot of trial and error, it's still Come next along, to better impossible not to get hit by these things. Let us take advantage of our head start. Oh, fucking piece of shit, I know you're there. Okay, so eliminating Heather is now number one, two, three, and five. There's also the traditional annoying backwards fall bullshit. Whenever you get hit, you fly back, right? You're familiar with that. But here, even if you're facing the other direction, you get sucked back into the hole. Except on this shot. Holy mother of hell! What is that about? That doesn't even follow the laws of physics. Cody, you look sick. You then there's the falling ceiling you? gag, you know, for you to get by, a... they have to fall. There's no other option. If you stand under it, it Here kills you. To get it down, doesn't. you stand under it. What a paradox. Look at this pandemonium. There's a fucking ceiling real. waiting oh, yeah. to come down I'll and kill me. There's a guy throwing an oil drum. If I try to get out of the way, I get hit by these rotating blades and shit. Take the guy down and I try to set off the ceiling trap and... I'm dead. Do you like that idea? Fuck you, sure. So I try it again, and this time I just kid, carefully right? step to the edge, just taking like baby steps, you know. God! This game's fucking brutal! It doesn't even make any sense! Do Come on, you piece of shit! What? Okay, Hurry. so I'm trying to jump onto a moving platform while somebody's shooting at me. How the hell does that work? Oh, shit. No, I Whoa, I got lucky there. I just heard it, and it smells like egg salad. It was high too, it was like, oh, it was a little lower. So I'm just gonna try to shoot him from across the hole, but the as you can see, I can't. Train. Just gotta get on there. The yes. uh, One more try, I just can't get my, hit. Uh, come on, come on, you motherfucker! Uh, thanks God. Okay, and how do you like this? You can actually get blocked no by a power But he can still shoot through. That's not fair! 
deliberately program this thing to be a means of torture. She is smart. There's also a slide okay. move, and I never really found a safe time to use it, so half the time I forgot I had it. Next. The only I thing easy about this her. game are the bosses, she does not get except for the Joker. We are voting against so overall it's really not, not the worst Batman game. game. It's not really that bad of a game in general. It just has some things bad that suck. Would you like to play a bad game, Batman? How about the Game Boy version? Return of the Joker! But it would be unwise to appear too strong. Just okay. I don't Return require a joke on Game Boy. Thanks game to my alliances and what does it sound like? So I lay in wait like a crocodile. I devilishly handsome. I don't know why I'm making all these observations. I guess I just have Mega Man on the mind. So anyway, it's completely different from the NES version. Your main attack is punching, but you can also collect other weapons. And the wall jump is back too, so it's actually more like the first NES game. But there's also a grappling hook, which is really annoying because you can never get it to work when you need it to work. It's like jumble hunt. You ever play jumble and other times, it just has a mind of its own. The control is overly complicated. It seems they should have just had the wall jump or the grappling hook, not both. Here there's deadly sewer water rising up. I'm desperately trying to make my way to platforms, but instead I keep bouncing around the place. Oh yes, I am. All right, so I'm just trying to get the power up. Would you like to calm down? Maybe we can find you some more cake. Oh, ah, missed again. All right, here we go. Just want to get there. We go. Okay, see, so I got the power up, and I just want to land on that thing, but it isn't even. And then the grappling Grappling hook goes up. I don't want to go that way. I want to go to the right. All right, I made it. Now the wall jump like sends me back. It's like I didn't want to go back. I want to go to the right. The controls are like trying to get a horse to wipe its ass on an eagle. I really hate that grappling hook. Okay, now jump. All right, here we go again. Fuck! I swear that these games were programmed by the Joker. Oh, I can't believe this. Get up there! Up there! That's it. I can't play this game anymore. I can't even finish the first fucking level. I also declare you the Joker. Did you just play Return of the Joker? Return of the Joker. so long to destroy the crates. All it is is just a power-up. It should take one shot. It's like in Fester's Quest, all those fucking purple blobs you gotta shoot. Oh, so you have a kick? I got it. Alright, kick for the crates and fire power for everything else. What's with the gargoyle statue? You shoot them and get nothing. What's the point? And why does it hurt you to touch them? Batman can't even touch a fucking statue? Really, make it have to go. gargoyle statues, ones that attack. Die. She's in the head and uh, nothing yeah, happens. She's do. down in the, like, the midsection, nothing happens. Really, really oh my true. god. Jeez. What am I supposed to do here? I just keep shooting them and nothing happens. Alright, this doesn't. I'm trying to slide into them, nothing happens. Oh my god. Alright, this time I'm going to try jumping over. That doesn't work either. I try hitting them in every spot that I can. Okay, so you can kill them? I just don't know how to do it. But, what you motherfucker? Oh my god! Okay, so what's with this fucking bullshit? What, they just die whenever they feel like it? Like, is it a glitch? Or is it like some obscure trick that I don't know about? It's just the first level of the game. Again, the first fucking level and I can't go any further. I've had what enough of this catastrophe. Interesting. What is our goal? I've had enough of this shit. Wow. Leave them alone. <laughs> okay, okay. Hold on to your halter top. Two votes for Heather. What? Did Courtney vote twice? Two votes for Sierra. I'm sorry. My name is Sierra Cody now. It's her And four votes. Man. I am weeping. Obviously, you can't do it on the outside of hell. 
I'm gonna shove these fucking games up your ass. Batman Revenge the Joker. Batman Return the Joker. Batman Forever. Batman Return the Joker on Game One. And last but not least, Batman on Power 64. Think the audience will like me for that? Holy shit! Total! Mama!